Hello guys, my name is Rahul and you are watching Mobiton. So guys, today I will explain what is the difference between hydraulic suspension and nitrox suspension. While purchasing a vehicle, the manufacturer specifically defined the nitrox suspension. As a customer, we had a question. So what is the reason behind and why the nitrox suspension is more better than a hydraulic suspension? So in this video, we are going to understand what is the difference between hydraulic suspension and nitrox suspension. So friends, if you are new to my channel, then please subscribe to my channel and stay tuned and watch the full video. So firstly we will understand the basic function of suspension and how does it work. Basically suspension composed of a spring, rebound adjuster, bearing, hydraulic oil, piston, seal block and piston rod. All these components set together to form a shock absorber. Suspension work in two cycle, the compress cycle and extension cycle. The compress cycle occur as a piston move downward compressing the hydraulic fuel inside the chamber below the piston and extension cycle occur as a piston move toward the top of the pressure tube and pressing the fluid in the chamber above the piston. So now, why nitrox suspension is better in terms of the stability and comfort than a hydraulic suspension? The hydraulic suspension use oil and piston for a shock absorb. While the travelling of an off-road condition for a long time, due to the heavy jerk, the oil present in a suspension turn into a foam, which affect the bumping ability of the suspension. This foaming usually caused by the air bubble in oil during suspension in action. This is similar as shaking a can of an oil after the shaking of an oil inside the can turn into a foam. Similarly, the same case happened to the hydraulic suspension also, as this the foam temporarily reduced the bumping ability of the piston. So now, in order to solve this problem, nitrox suspension came into an existence, which secondary cylinder connected to the suspension, which act as a reservoir of an oil and pressurized gas that is nitrogen. The pressurized nitrogen gas inside the cylinder prevent the forming of hydraulic oil inside the suspension during a heavy usage. Due to this, the performance and efficiency of the suspension remain constant. This nitrogen gas also help in absorbing the jerk of an off-road and provide smooth riding for both rider and pillion. The new Bajaj Pulsar 200NS, Pulsar 200RS and some other motor vehicles use nitrox suspension. Nitrox suspension provide a better stability and also provide comfortable long ride to the riders as the performance remain unchanged since the foaming never occur. This is the reason that nitrox suspension is far more better than a hydraulic suspension. So now you could understand which one is better. While you will go for a purchasing vehicle, you could differentiate between hydraulic suspension and nitrox suspension. Hope you understand the difference between. If you had any question then write in and comments. Hope you enjoyed the video and thank you for watching. If the video is helpful to you, like, share and subscribe. Until the next time, goodbye.